The American West is famous for its expansive lands and beautiful mountain ranges, and Arizona is no exception. The state that is home to the Grand Canyon is also a neighbor to Nevada, a state with notoriously lax laws on exotic animals where even big cats can be kept as pets. Arizona, however, is very different from Nevada. In fact, the state is fairly restrictive on exotic pets, banning members of the order carnivore outright, with two exceptions. While you can't have tigers, bears, or hyenas in Arizona, you can have a pet wolf, kind of. Arizona only prohibits a purebred wolf. However, nearly 100% of so-called wolves that are in the pet trade, and even many zoos, are actually wolf dogs. This means they have some percentage of dog DNA. Although they are not recent so-called wolf hybrids, most wolf dogs are produced through pairings of two wolf dogs with varying content. Even wolf dogs deemed low content, however, will look like wolves to the average person. Yet they still fall under the definition of domesticated in the state. Just like wolf dogs, Savannah cats are another hybrid pet that is considered to be domesticated in Arizona law. Savannah cats are produced by a cross with domestic cats and the African serval, and even so-called high-content or F1 Savannah cats that have a pure serval as a parent are legal in the state. There are several rodents that are also legal as pets that might be considered to be something you'd only see in a zoo. You can specifically keep the African crested porcupine as a pet, despite its intimidating appearance, as well as the largest rodent in the world, the semi-aquatic capybara. Other exotic rodents, such as the Patagonian mara, are also legal. Sugar gliders and hedgehogs are two mainstream exotic pets that are sometimes banned in other states. However, they are at least, thankfully, legal in Arizona. Aside from sugar gliders, there are other marsupials that can be legally owned in the state. Surprisingly, two macropods are legal, the wallaby and the kangaroo. While you can't have our only native marsupial, the Virginia opossum, in Arizona, the more popular short-tailed opossum is legal to own there. What about reptiles? Many states, such as New York, ban large constrictor snakes. However, the reticulated python, which is one of the longest snakes in the world, is actually legal in Arizona. Last but not least, you can actually own an American bison in Arizona. While other large, potentially dangerous animals are easily placed on prohibition lists around the country, if another large species that is easily capable of killing humans has usage in agriculture, it will often remain legal to own. Of course, most people don't own bison as pets. They are kept as livestock in the same vein as cows and sheep. In the eyes of our culture, there's nothing strange about this, unlike keeping an exotic animal merely for companionship. The state of Arizona has needlessly made several species illegal to own as pets, and this is particularly unfortunate considering the state has an inexpensive, affordable acreage that would allow many to responsibly keep animals that require more space. It is just another consequence of misinformation that is spread about the exotic pet trade and the people who have the desire to own something a little less conventional.